Hey YouTube, it's Pete's Apple Help. And uh, today I'm going to be showing you how to um, down um, the jailbreak um, iPod, iPhone, or iPad um, from any firmware or anything. So it's for jailbreaking an iPod, iPad, or iPhone. Um, it says work for the iPod and iPhone 3.1.3 firmware, or any firmware that you have, or any generation. It works with anything, trust me. Now, first thing we're going to do is, I'm going to show you that this is not a jailbroken, uh, wait a minute. Okay. Um, and as you can see, camera sucks. <laughs> Um, I do not have Cydia or any other jailbreaking apps. It's unjailbroken, nothing. So now, the first thing you're going to want to do is go onto your computer and go to this website, http colon slash slash spiritjb.com. Um, and... I'll put a link in the description so you can just click on that and go straight to the site. Now, they have two versions for it. They have a Windows version and a Mac OS X version. And, of course, I'll be using Windows. So, I'm going to click on Windows. And I'm going to hit Save. Now, I'm going to pick the destination I want to save. So, I'm going to save it under My Documents. So, save there. And then up here, I have Spirit. I'm going to double click on that. And then you're just going to hit run. And then all you have to do is, and it says, and it says what device you're plugging in right now. So it's iPod Touch 2nd Generation 3.1.3 connected. And that's exactly what this is. And to prove that this is 3.1.3, I'm going to show you. I'm going to have to go into settings, general, about. And right there it says version 3.1. Well, let me focus. Come on now, focus. Well, I guess you can kind of see it says 3.1.3. See, right there you saw it a second ago. So, 3. Point, well, you saw it earlier, okay? You saw it 3.1.3. So now all you're going to do is you are going to click. Ah, oh, stupid camera. Okay, all you gotta do is click the word jailbreak. And it says jailbreaking. Now, watch this. You hear the little thing. The apple sign comes up. Up here to say jailbreak success. And then you just gotta hit quit. But now, down here, has a spirit symbol. Now don't worry, it's not broken. And the little gray bar right there shows the progress of your jailbreaking. So right now it's jailbreaking. And my computer just detected it and it popped up. And it's still jailbreaking. It's about halfway done now. There should be a white bar on a gray line that shows your progress. So almost there and it just went around now you should be getting a spinning circle wheel thing and it should pop up any second now there we go and let's put my password okay and over here we have Cydia zoom in on that it'll focus Let me see if I turn on the brightness, if that'll help. I'll show you it did work. That helps a lot. Wow. And now uh, you can see Cydia. Turn my light, maybe. Well, you can see I have Cydia. And I can go into that. And you can see it says recognizing automatically whatever. And I'll connect to a Wi-Fi. 
And by the way, for Cydia, you do have to have Wi-Fi, so... And, um, this is the easiest jailbreak I've ever seen out there. And I've heard that Black Rain is almost the same thing, but I don't think you can do 3.1.3. And when, um, and when I downloaded it, it was kind of, it said it was broken in some way. So, I tried Spirit, and that turned out to be a lot better. Well... After this is done, the city of things should pop up. There is um, another YouTuber out there called Ty's iPhone Help. It's T Y S I P H O N E and then H E L P. He uh, he actually found out how to do this from him, so I would uh, probably check out his videos. He's doing an iPad giveaway, which I entered like 50 million times. And yeah, you can see right there I still have Cydia. So that's the easiest way to jailbreak any firmware on an iPod, iPhone, or iPod Touch. Please comment, rate, subscribe, and you know, check out all my other videos. And uh, yeah, see you later. Bye.